Alright guys, here is the uh, quad cube. It's a new cube out there that wasn't made by Rubik. It was uh, some other company, but I saw it at the mall, picked it up, and I looked it up on YouTube, and there was no solution tutorials on how to do it. So I'm going to post this up here, and I don't use algorithms. I'm just going to say like up, over, and down and stuff like that. So if you want to learn how to do this, just follow along, and I'll try to explain it as best I can. So when you're looking at this, all you have to imagine is that it's just four 2x2s. So if you know how to solve a 2x2, that's great. And for this, you really need to know how to solve a 3x3. If you know how to solve a 3x3, you're going to be perfect. If you know how to solve a 2x2, you're going to be good. So first what you have to do is just scramble up the cube. When you scramble it, it does get to be a mumble jumble mess. So the first step, what you want to do is you want to get it lined up as it was when you first started. So that looks like four diagonal two by twos, just like that. And uh, the first step you have to do is you just have to pick a corner, any corner you want. I'm gonna go, just pick any corner. It doesn't matter. Pick this one or this one. I'm gonna start down here. And you have to find the white side first because that's how this one's done, it's just white's the easiest. And you have to put it toward the top. And uh, you'll see the white, purple, and green spot. That's going to be in this position here. Your first step is getting that white, green, and purple from magenta, pink, whatever, into that spot right here. So it's right in this upper top corner when you look at it in the front like this. That's your first step of getting it. And then you just solve it like a normal 2x2. Two two. Just pretend that this is a 2x2, two two, but these three right here is just this one corner. That's all you have to do is just think outside of the box. Just pretend that this is a 2x2. Two two. That is your first step. And then just solve it normally. So put the corners in how they go. Like here's the green corner. So you want to put it down so that it lines up with that. Then you have to find here's the blue one. Then you have one more corner to put in. And then you have the bottom like that. Just like you're doing a normal 2x2. Two two. And then you look at the top, like it's the yellow side. And then this is just one corner. You still have to remember that this is just one corner for now. And you have these two, and there's a corner facing out. And then this is the yellow one facing out that way. And you just do like, you'll want to solve the yellow. It's like the up, over, down one. Like that. And then you just keep putting it in the right spots and just keep solving it like a 2x2 two two and keep repeating the steps that you would normally do on a 2x2. Two two. And you still have to remember that these three corners are they're supposed to be, they're just the 2x2, two two. you just have to remember that. They're still part of it, you just don't even think that they're there. Okay, so now you have the yellow, because if you have three like this, then you're going to have it done, and you have the blue is done and the red's done, so you just line it up, and that's your first step. You have the first corner solved like this, okay? Now, your second step, you don't go down to this corner, you just work your way down. Like, you have this one done, so now you work on this one. And now, this is a corner, and this, these two are a corner. You just have to really think outside of the box. Now, you have the yellow side facing up, or the white side facing up like this, and it's green and purple like that, so you have to find that corner, which is right here, and put it in the same spot. Like here is that corner, and here's this corner. You have to put it in the same spot, which they already are, so that's great. Now you just do it again. You have to solve it like you normally would. Just pretend that it's a giant two by two, and just pretend that these other big things aren't there. They're just little corners. OK? 
Okay, so now you have the bottom white done, like this. Have it all lined up. So now you're going to work on the yellow, which is the top. And just keep doing those algorithms to solve the top of it. I'm not explaining those algorithms, that's why you should know how to do these. And that's top like that. The yellow's done. Now you just have to do the one that solves the corners for it. And that one's solved like that. And sometimes it might solve itself like this has, but if it doesn't, then you just keep working it down. And when you're doing those big ones that like twist out like weird ways, where you like do back twice and stuff like that, and it keeps getting scrambled up, just keep following it because it will fix itself. Okay, you just have to keep going for that. And sometimes it'll solve itself like this. So now you have one more, which is this corner, and you have to find there's the white, green, and purple one. You have to put that corner in the same spot, like that, and then just solve it like a normal 2x2. Two two. Like that. And then you just finish it out, and sometimes it'll fix itself like it just did there. So there's a tutorial on how to do the quad cube. Uh, I tried explaining it as best as I could, so if you have trouble with it, just post a comment down there. And I'll see if I can help you out in any way, and I might make a better version of this video in the future. So, thanks for watching. See you.